Hey guys, I'm Colin Fawson. We're here today to talk about parallax and why it's important for precision rifle and target shooting. A lot of scopes have an adjustable parallax. You'll find that opposite of the windage turret. When we talk about parallax, we're talking about adjusting the focal plane on which the reticle sits within the rifle scope to sit on the same focal plane that we're trying to view our target at. And by putting those two on the same plane, we are removing any optical error in shift of adjustment that you might see from the reticle to where the point of impact is. So another way of understanding this is that we have two fixed points. We have a scope and we have a target. And what we're doing with the reticle is we're actually inducing, we're putting this reticle or object in the middle of these two lines. When you put a third point between two things, you can end up with some sort of offset between two points. So by moving that reticle to line up with our target point, we have taken out any of the objective error that we have by not having our parallax corrected. So by adjusting the parallax, we're actually lining up the reticle to be on the same focal plane as the target. A lot of the Maven scopes are marked in what are equivalent yardage distances. Parallax is especially important for zeroing and for shooting at precise targets. The reason that we want to be very precise with our parallax for zeroing is that we're trying to very find that very fine aiming point and get a very tight group at a specific range. The same thing happens when we're trying to shoot targets at distance. We want to have as tight a group as possible while maintaining that precision for small accuracy groups. One of the ways to check parallax at distance is to set your rifle up in a steady rest or, or on a bench, and then get behind your rifle without moving it and move your head within the scope field of view so that you can see if your reticle starts to move on that static target. When it is moving on that static target, you have an offset in parallax and your target focus. So you wanna adjust your parallax until the two things are focused correctly and you have mitigated all of the movement error that you might see of the reticle on that target. 